Welcome back everyone. In this video, I want to quickly cover how to extract a components prop types, which is based off the react.component props we had a look at in the previous video. Now at some point in time, you might want to reuse a components prop types, but you don't have access to the type itself. Perhaps because it is from a library that you don't have access to. In such cases, you can extract prop types of an existing component. Let me show you an example. In the same HTML folder from the previous video, I've created a new file called customcomponent.tsx. Let's say this component needs the exact same props as the greet component. The greet component is a component we had a look at very early in the series. It accepts three props, name, an optional message count, and is logged in. Although we could export greet props, let's assume we can't. We don't have control over it. In this case, we can use react.componentProps to extract the props of the greet component. Let me show you how. In customComponent.tsx, I'm going to create a function component. So RAFC. And within parentheses, we specify props. Now the props need to be the same as the greet component props. So we can specify the type as react.componentProps. And then within angle brackets, we specify type of greet component. Now greet here is the component from greet.tsx, so make sure to import it at the top. Now in the JSX, if I type curly braces props dot, you can see the auto suggestion or autocomplete showing exactly the same props as the greet component. Is logged in, optional message count, and the name. So we are able to extract the prop types from one component and use them as prop types for another component. In this case, from greet component to the custom component. To be honest, you might not need this feature in your day-to-day -day work, but it doesn't hurt to know. And if you do come across this situation, you now know how to handle it. All right. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.